burrito time. Yeah, we're about to get a barbecue burrito. Sounds delicious. Anyways, uh, I'm pretty, pretty pumped. Pretty excited. <laughs> Trying to drive y'all. Interesting show today. Angel found out uh, there's a uh, place that sells uh, a barbecue burrito. I guess it's a sampler platter with uh, brisket, some chorizo, some mac and cheese, and some other meats, all combined in inside a flour tortilla. Simone, I'm pretty hungry. Just got done lifting some weights, trying to put some muscle on. Now I'm about to get my grub on, and let's go pick up Rangel. Just ride out. Oh, that was close. Man, I don't know why the fire department is so selfish. What in a hurry for? What up? I do actually. It's been a while. So sweet. Moving out of what? Yeah. I'm definitely moving with you. Wow. It's fun, dude. I need someone to cook and clean. <laughs> you know you're in Southgate when you're like passing through the Curaçao. Why? Why Santa Monica? Beach is around. I want to go to the beach every month. More, your, more of your kind of people? Yup. Crazies. Hold those way. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even cross my mind, dude. Right. I didn't. He, was, he was hoping that I would forget. I'm saying, dude. No wonder when this went down. No That's wonder. <laughs> Because it's hot in here, man. Hot. <laughs> in which episode trivia has Zio ever ever put his windows down? Other trivia, nigga. They know it was this episode. <laughs> this episode. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Fun fact. <laughs> yeah, what, what's how do you pronounce that? Duroc? Duroc, yeah. Duroc. What is it? So it's a, it's a different kind of radio. It's a, think of it like light like Angus of a, of a full pork, pork in general. The pork is red, it just has way more marlin than any any of a generic full pork. So it's fatter? It's, yeah, man. Okay, it's cool. More marlin, twice as juicier as any Ooh, regular. Sounds good. I'm not the ready one. You that in the burrito too. Awesome. Okay, we'll do those too. Cares about the menu, we just want to see how it tastes. I'm about to find out right now. Go ahead, that one's yours. That one's mine. Oh my god. So, what are they having? They got beans, barbecue beans, chorizo, sausage, <laughs> <laughs> uh, brisket, mac and cheese, and some other meat. Now, you want to dig in first? Down. What do you say? Uh, originally it didn't come with it, but he said it goes well with it. But I'm going to try it first without it. There we go. Damn, bit your finger. Cool. Yo, those lips. Okay. Wow. Damn. This is bomb. You try it. Mm -hmm. Try it first and we'll talk. Then we'll talk. I don't want to talk. Got a little of the lips. 
I think I could put this whole thing in my mouth. What you think? Bro, what's this? Oh, you, get hit the, you, get, you get the hit from the, the chorizo, which has a little spice to it. I don't get that part yet. See, I, I only got one. Well, actually, I did. I didn't even like <laughs> <laughs> And you can taste the beans. You know what? You can taste the beans. You can taste the brisket. The mac and cheese is really good. Um, but it's missing something. Barbecue sauce. Huh? Missing the barbecue sauce. A little thin. In order to get the... I mean, because you, you taste all the meat, so you just you want that ex barbecue experience. Um, it is fine now. Hit yeah. that G spot for sure. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the, the meat's uh, great. It's tender, it's moist. Okay, it falls apart. The home run with that sauce. The combination of everything is actually pretty good. Like I wasn't looking forward to macaroni, but macaroni is like the rice. The mac and cheese. Oh, well, it says like the rice and the carne asada. Oh, okay. But it's all so well combined together and it's freaking, you know, freaking delicious. If you want, bro, you can do all the talking. <laughs> I'm enjoying this. So delicious, guys. It's hard to put into words, but that barbecue sauce, it's not spicy, it's not too sweet. It's a good combination. And what I like about it, you could add it on your own, so some places the barbecue sauce is already integrated and it's overwhelming. But you can kind of control it on your own and, man, look at the meat, dude. Just, falls off. Mm. It's not when you're barbecuing, you know, like, why bother getting everything to the side? Combine all that in one big-ass burrito. So this is genius. Yeah. The burritos are the best, man. Look at it. All in one. What do they call it? Like, it's called a man, uh, man meat burrito. Man meat burrito. Oh, meat man. Oh, meat Direct man, it. sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's delicious. Perfect. So they have different levels of barbecue sauce? Okay. One pump. One pump. You got one pump guy? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he said one pump. You know, I wasn't ready to eat this much food early in the morning. I'm always ready to eat all the food on me. But oh, man. It's just good. It's good. But the barbecue sauce has a nice kick to it. Honestly, we wish you were here. But I wouldn't share. It's deceiving though. Why? Because you know you're holding a, a burrito, right? Probably in Florida, yeah, but you're not getting the, the carne asada, you're getting bomb ass um, barbecue. You know what's funny? I forgot that we're even holding a tortilla. So that's how much I'm into it right now. Really? Yeah, like I didn't realize that we were holding up the tea. You know, that's what burritos are made up of. Right. Wow, 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 dejo el perro. <laughs> no words can describe my happiness at that moment in time, which is freaking delicious. <laughs> <laughs> that moment in time? Yeah. Isn't that a song? Maybe. <laughs> Turn the car. Get some, some air going. Uh, what can we say? Man, dude, the best barbecue sauce ever. Definitely. For sure. Um, the cool thing about it is that they don't put the barbecue sauce in the burrito. And you can integrate it on your, on your own slowly, but you know, slowly but surely. But you can add it in little by little. And oh my gosh, 
the cheese on the mac and cheese. They had a uh, brisket, pork, pulled pork. Try, try tip, yeah, try tip. No, a big old okay. big, big piece of meat with tri tip and um, and beans. Honestly, I didn't even taste the beans. That they was they they got lost in the mac and cheese and the, the meat. There's so much going on, but so much flavor going on too all together. As you know, the sauce penetrates. <laughs> Dude, it was. It's uh, pretty cool because you can taste the smokiness too from the wood on, on some ends, you know. Um, and like I said, barbecue sauce is not too spicy. It has a little kick to it, which is perfect. It has a nice sweetness to it also that just marinates, uh, it just marries so well with the meat. It's so perfect. And then the cheese, when you're biting into it, the creaminess from the, the cheese and the pasta with the, the carne. That's creamy, oh, bro? It was creamy, delicious. Mm. Yeah, dude. Uh, I'm just lost in words on how delicious. You know what? Out of all the burritos I've been to, like, yeah, this is way different because it's not, nothing like carne asada. Obviously, it's barbecue. But I never imagined, like, you know, you walking up to, like, a back barbecue and, like, putting your, your plate on the food. And then. Like barbecue? I mean, like, a back. Like, like back <laughs> no, 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 a back. Not black. Back. You know, like, in a backyard, you know, like, having a. <laughs> hey, whatever. What I'm trying to say. What I'm trying to say. You know, there's no need. You know, when you go to places, you put your food all around, scattered, yeah, yeah, yeah. and here, bang, throw all this in one tortilla, dude, ready to go. It's just, oh man, it's delicious. It was good. So, I mean, you guys saw how it was made. It was perfect. Everything makes the tortilla makes everything perfect. You just put it all in one end. You're good to go. You don't have to cut it, add it with anything else, or mix it with anything else. It's just all in, integrated already. So. Definitely a spot you guys need to check out called Ray's Barbecue here in Huntington Park. And uh, our angel put the, the link below. And I also want to give a shout out to the people who work here. It's family owned, so thank you for letting us be here and letting us be in your kitchen. See you put the massive deliciousness together. Thank you, guys. And other than that, man, just thanks for watching. Yeah, guys, thank you uh, once again for these guys. And thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys uh, like. Subscribe and uh, share with everybody else. Uh, hopefully you guys come and check out the burrito yourselves and then give your own reviews. All right, until next time. All right, peace out, burrito guys.